Hi, it's Mr. Cully. Um, in this video, we're going to look at two different ways of controlling a sprite using the mouse rather than keys. So, this first one, I've got, say, a little paddle sprite here that I want to be able to move left and right when I move the mouse across the screen. So, the first way to do that is put a forever in, and forever, I want to set X because X is across the screen. Y is up and down. X is across if you remember your maths and your um, your axes on your graphs. Set X to. And I don't want to set a particular value here. I want it to sense where my mouse is across the screen. So I'll go to sensing and I would choose mouse X. And that's it. Now when I click the green flag, the X position of the paddle will be the same as my mouse whilst I'm on the stage, so I can move it around like that. If you wanted to be up and down instead of left to right, you'd get rid of mouse X and you'd put mouse Y in. So let's have a go at that. Ah oh, no, hang on. It will be set Y to mouse Y. Let me just get that right to show you. Set Y to mouse Y. There we go. So that should go up and down like so. You could even put both of them in. Set X to mouse X. And then it would follow the mouse around the screen like that. Now that might be a bit easy for some games. Um, so what I'm going to do is just get rid of that. I'm going to import a new sprite. Let's say we have a fish eating game where we've got a shark trying to chase some fish around the screen and eat them. Where's my shark? There it is. Okay. There's my shark. Um, what I can do for my shark is when the green flag is clicked, point towards mouse pointer and move and the smaller the number, the slower it'll move, the bigger the number, the quicker it'll move. Let's try five steps for the moment. Um, I'm going to need to put that into a forever, like so. And so this shark, if I just make it a little bit smaller, there we go, should follow my point towards my mouse pointer and move towards it. There we go. So it chases it around the screen. That might make your gameplay a little bit more interesting than having instant control. So those are two ways of controlling sprites using the mouse. 